In this video, we will design a 3D helix in BookSketch. So for this, just type in helix. Or you can also find this option in the ribbon under draw. And then under polyline. So here you see it. So select it. And then it asks to specify a center point of base. Pick a point and then specify the base radius. So for example, take 50. Then it asks us to specify the top radius. I'm going to take the same one as the base radius, so 50. And then we need to specify a height. At this point, you'll also see four options appearing at the right side. So the first one is the axis endpoints. This defines your helix height and your helix orientation. The second one is the number of turns. So for example, we can take 8 turns. The third one is your turn height. So together with the number of turns, this defines your helix height. You also have a fourth option, which is a twist direction. When you select this, you can type CW for clockwise and CCW for counterclockwise. Okay, so now we have our helix. On the right side in the properties step, you can still adjust all the properties you just defined. So for example, I'm going to adjust my turn height. And then you see the helix becomes a bit higher. You can do the same with all the other properties. Okay, now we are going to draw a circle at the base point. Make it as small or as big as you like. And then type in sweep. Select the profile entity, which is a circle, and then select the sweep path, which is the helix. Press enter. And this can take a while. Okay, so now the circle is swept across the helix, and that leaves us with our 3D helix. Thank you for watching.